Welcome to Pop Show 2022! My name is Ryan Yoder and I am the very proud choir director at Bonita High School, the greatest high school on earth. All right, so as they're transitioning back there, every concert we've had, I've done a little exercise with us all, just taking attendance to see who's in the audience and get to know who's here. So we're going to do a quick little game here, all right? It's actually your first basic rhythm exercise. I'm going to ask you a question, all right? And the, if the answer is yes, you're going to clap a single time. So we're going to practice real quick. So I'm going to go one, two, three, single clap, all right? Get ready. Here we go. So just a practice round this time. Ready? One, two, three. Three. All right, you passed. Great, great, great. All right, so clap once if you were at our fall concert. Clap once if you were at Yuletide, our winter concert. And clap once if you were at our spring concert. Clap once if you were here last night. All right, and you still came back for more. That's awesome. All right, now clap once if this is your first time hearing our Bearcat singers this year. All right, it's always good when that's the quietest clap, all right? <laughs> now, I'm new to Bonita, but something that I know and I've learned now being here this year is that Bonita audiences are unapologetic applauders. Am I right? All right. So tonight you're in for a treat, and I'm expecting you guys to cheer on these kids with full might. 
Um, just a reminder, um, LVTV3 is filming the concert tonight, so we ask that you refrain from videoing or flash photography as it distracts the performers and distracts everybody in the audience, so we appreciate you uh, taking care of that for us. So, tonight, you will enjoy selections from your favorite movie musicals presented by all five of our award-winning choirs. Many of our medleys tonight feature multiple soloists. We ask that you hold your applause until the end of the entire medley so we can celebrate all our, for, all, all our performers. First up, we have Grease. Grease is a 1978 American musical romantic comedy film based on the 1971 musical of the same name. The film depicts the lives of greaser Danny Zuko the, uh, and Australian transfer student Sandy Olsen who develop an attraction for each other during a summer romance. Let's welcome Corral as they present Selections from Greece. Summer lovin' had me a blast Summer lovin' happened so fast I met a girl crazy for me Met a boy cute as can be Summer days drifting away to all, all the summer nights Well, 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 well. Tell, tell me more, more tell me more
All right, Corral. Next up, Men's Choir presents choral highlights from Jersey Boys, the story of four young men from the wrong side of the tracks in New Jersey who came together to form the iconic 1960s rock group, The Four Seasons. Take it away, Men's Choir. She walked in the room yeah, As I recall it ended much too soon I'm down and out, but I ain't about to go living my life without you. For every day, I made you cry. I'm paying girls till the day that I die. I'll be working my way back to you, babe. The burning love inside. Yeah, I'm working my way back to you, babe. The happiness that died. I let it
You're just too good to be true. Can't take my eyes off of you. You'd be like heaven to touch. I want to hold you so much. At long last, love has arrived. And I thank God I'm alive. You're just too good. Just too good to be true. Give another huge round of applause to Mrs. Carrie Redman for being such a good sport. Bonita High School math teacher, now I have to tell you, when I went to her, I asked her, I told her, now we're not going to tell you what's going to happen, but would you be willing to be a part of the show in some way that involves you getting brought on stage? And I told her I promised it was a sweet moment, and she was a real sport, and she told me, oh, Mr. Yoder, you just know I can't say no to you. So thank you for not saying no and allowing us to let you be a part of the show. All right. So uh, we have um, some more music where this came from. Um, after this next medley, it's our last medley, the first act, we will have a 15-minute intermission. But first, we're going to hear from our women's choir. Mamma Mia! is a jukebox musical based on the music of famed 70s pop group ABBA. The plot follows a young bride-to-be who invites three men to her upcoming wedding, with the possibility that any of them could be her father. Enjoy Women's Choir as they present our final medley of the first act, 
Mamma Mia highlights from the movie soundtrack.
Thank you.
Welcome back to Popsos 2022. <laughs> All right. Kicking off the second act will be concert choir presenting selections from Hairspray. Hairspray follows teenage Tracy Turnblad's dream to dance on the Corny Collins show. When Tracy wins a role on the show, she becomes a celebrity overnight, leading to social change as Tracy campaigns for the show's integration. Welcome back to the stage, Concert Choir. Like us on the break. 
Our final medley will be presented by the award-winning Bonita High School Chamber Singers. <laughs> Guys and Dolls is a musical romantic comedy involving the unlikeliest of Manhattan pairings. A high-rolling gambler and a puritanical missionary. A showgirl dreaming of the straight and narrow and a crap game manager who is anything but. The Chamber Singers present selections from Guys and Dolls. What's playing at the Roxy? I'll tell you what's playing at the Roxy. A uh, picture about a Minnesota man so in love with Miss B. Goyle that he sacrifices everything, moves all the way to Biloxi. That's what's playing at the Roxy. What's in the daily news? I'll tell you what's in the daily news. A story about a guy who bought his wife a small ruby with what otherwise would have been his union dues. That's what's in the daily news. What's happening all over? I'll tell you what's happening all over. Guys sitting home by television and said, who wants to be something of a rover? That's what's happening all over. Love is a thing that's up. And it looks like Nathan's just another victim. When you see a guy, whisper stars in the sky. You can bet some that he's doing it for some dog.
a horse right here, the name is Paul Revere. And here's a guy that says if the weather's clear, I'm can do, Valentine, cause can on the morning do. line, this, this guy's guy got him figured from do. five to nine. But has he can't the tap, horse he wins it by a half. According to this here in the telegraph, it makes friends that the horse makes friends. This guy called the horse big friends. I'm thinking Valentine, the horse was fine. Besides the jockeys, brothers of friends of mine. And just a minute, I got the great box noise. This guy says the horse the white friends. Valentine, I got the horse. for 
that plain little band of gold. A person can develop a cold. You can fit her all day with the vitamin A in the bowl of this. But the medicine never gets anywhere near what the trouble is. If she's getting that kind of a name for herself in the name and his, a person can develop a cold. And furthermore, just from stalling and stalling and stalling the wedding trip, a person can develop a grip. I got on the boat to heaven, and by some chance I had brought my dice along, and there I stood, and I hollered, someone fade me! But the passengers, they knew right from wrong. So I said to myself, sit down, sit down, you're on the boat. People have said, sit down, sit down, you're welcome the boat. And the devil will drive you under, play the shot, the bell of your checker drums. Sit down, sit down, sit down, sit down, sit down, you're welcome the boat. And as I laughed at those passengers to heaven, ha 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 ha, a great big wave came and washed me overboard. And as I sank and I hollered, someone save me, that's the moment I woke up, thank the Lord. Our final number tonight is going to open with a feature from the class of 2022. Would you guys come to the flat part of the stage, please? So we're so grateful for this opportunity to honor you and allow you to sing one last time, one last pop show as a class, a senior class together. Um, I have to say, in thinking about this class, this is probably the most resilient class of seniors I've ever seen in my life. And as I've watched them grow this year and watched them uh, perform this final time, the realization that the last time they had a pop show, they were 
freshmen in high school, and now they're here now as seniors the next time after a long pandemic. Let's give a huge round of applause for that. So savor these last few moments singing as a class. These are the memories I'm sure you'll remember for a lifetime. And now, ladies and gentlemen, the class of 2022. I guess they like you. <laughs> just a little bit, just a little bit. All right, well, I have the distinguished uh, privilege of thanking some people that have made tonight happen. First, can we give a huge round of applause to our pop show band behind all these students? We are so grateful, as I said, Bonita High School is the greatest high school on earth. Am I right, kids? <laughs> and a lot of what makes it great is obviously these students, but the teachers and staff that support them. Um, we're so grateful to have in the audience tonight our assistant principal, Mrs. Joy Lindsay, here supporting the kids. As well as countless others, uh, Bonita High School teachers and staff in the audience, and we thank you for supporting these students and allowing them to do what they do. 
We're grateful to be supported by an incredible district. I tell the kids all this and all the time and you guys at every concert, but we are so lucky to be in an incredible district that supports the arts. Can we give a huge round of applause to all of our <laughs> district office that supports us? as well as the huge privilege of performing in the Bonita Center for the Arts. Can we give a round of applause to the Bonita for the Center of Arts? Tech crew, Patrick Hedeker, the arts manager here. And finally, I'd like to thank our, our parents who are been super behind the scenes supporting these kids. Um, I can't tell you, all of the, the things you see up here, um, it's impossible for one person to do. And I am so grateful that we've had such supportive parents Specifically, I would like to highlight one tonight who has really been the right arm of this program supporting these kids, especially who will be our president next year on our parent board, and that is Mrs. Tanya Chisaka. Will you come out? To... We have some flowers for you. And she'll hold on to it. And she's asked for me to turn the mic over to her so you can grab that mic. She has some thank yous for some parents as well. So I'll turn it over to Mrs. Chisaka. What a great show. I was bawling in the sides going, okay, pull it together, you gotta talk. Um, I have a senior and I've known most of these kids who are graduating since they were nine years old in fourth grade honor choir. So they're my babies. This year I had 158 choir kids and it's, all of this and all of the festivals and all of the concerts and all of the things we've done this year wouldn't have been possible without a great parent board. And we'd just like to take a minute right now to recognize the parent board members that have seniors that are gonna be moving on. And we just also wanna welcome anyone who wants to join our parent board to look for that email in the fall. <laughs> um, 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 Joey's mom, Taryn. Amanda's mom, Susie, and just for practicality, we're gonna have the kids give their moms these bouquets when they go out in a minute. <laughs> Brianna's mom, Belki. <laughs> Bella's mom, Catherine. Mateus's mom, Liz. Thank you. All right. Well, I have to say first a huge thank you to all these kids in front of you. Um, you guys are the 160 reasons I have to get up in the morning, and I'm just so grateful that this is the way we get to end our year together. So thank you for a fantastic year. Can we... Are you tough? We, we have two more people to thank. Two you more, do? Two more yeah. Things. So this is not planned. Dr. Swartz! <laughs> Where is he? Come up here. It's also Dr. Schwartz's birthday tonight, and he's spending it here tonight. I was going to say that! I was going to say that! All right. This is Dr. Schwartz. He's our accompanist. And we cannot thank him enough for... We cannot, we cannot thank him enough for playing all of the music for all five of the choirs, for keeping up with us, for keeping up with Mr. Yoder changing the tempo all the time. <laughs> Everything, all of the above. We are forever grateful that you came here and put up with all of us. Thank you so much. I threw you under the bus. One more, one more person to this. Okay, we have one more person to thank, and it is our fearless leader, Mr. Always Right. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Yoder. <laughs> Congratulations. Okay, okay, I have to talk, I have to talk. 
No. <laughs> Stop chanting. <laughs> Thank you so much. Uh, this is your first year. Congratulations on making it through one year at Bonita. <laughs> uh, Survived. We look. We look forward to many more years with you, many more pop shows, and uh, thank you for getting us through reintroduction into regular school after the pandemic, and just making choir a great time. So, thank you, Mr. Yoda. I love you all. All right, are you ready for us to sing something more for you? All right, we're gonna sing you out. All right, band, take it away. We'll do a little encore for him and send you out. <laughs> 